Hello YouTube, Simon here, welcome back to the channel and I've got a little tip to share with you here for Final Fantasy IX uh, one you're going to want to know about right from the very start of the game really uh, because it's going to help us with an ability called Thievery later on which is powered up by the number of times you successfully steal but here's the thing, every successful steal that you achieve in the game is going to count towards the increased damage of the Thievery skill even before you've gained access to the Thievery skill itself so this is something you really do want to be working on right from the get-go. I'm just going to give credit as well to Red Mario, one of our viewers uh, and an all-knowledgeable Final Fantasy fan uh, for sharing this tip because it is an important one. So the way this works, the way the calculation works is that thievery, the damage from thievery, which by the way is fantastic because it can't be defended against even with the protect spell, is going to be the number of successful steals the player has accomplished multiplied by the speed stat of Zidane, who is the person that will be using the thievery skill. So, for example, if we look at Zidane right now, we can see his speed stat is 23. Later on, by the time we've got the thievery skill, that will be a little bit higher. Uh, let's say, for example, his speed stat is 30, and we, by that point, have successfully stolen 100 items. That will be 100 multiplied by 30 giving us 3000 and what we're going to do is divide that by 2 giving us a damage total of 1500 damage per hit with thievery which might not sound like a lot but this is what I'm you know trying to give you in form uh, in tip form right now if we start stealing from the get go and stealing every single enemy in the game then by the time we actually gain access to the thievery skill it's going to be a lot of damage Okay, so we stole a potion. We've literally just boosted the damage of our future thievery skill. And I'm still right at the beginning of the game here. And we're just going to make a habit of doing this every time we're grinding, every time we encounter random enemies, every time we fight bosses. By the way, it doesn't matter if we steal even with the other party members that have access to the skill early on, such as Sinner, uh, and Marcus, etc. It doesn't make any difference. All we're going to do is to steal from every single enemy, and that will boost up the... Uh, you know the damage of thievery and thievery is one of several skills that can be boosted in this way so there's uh, also dragon fang which we'll talk about in a future video which is based which is a skill for freya and that's based upon the number of dragons you've defeated and also there's frog catch i believe it's called which is one of queen of skills uh, and that's based on the number of uh, frogs that you've caught so uh, there's a few spells that are based on repetitive tasks like this. Uh, thievery just happens to be one of them. I escaped that battle because sometimes RNG just is not in your favour, is it, when it comes to stealing. Uh, later on, we can boost the success chance of steals, uh, but not for the common or uncommon slots, only for the rare and very rare slots, uh, which is fine. But these wolves have a couple of items to steal from. There we go, look, a potion. Uh, but they can be a little bit trickier in my opinion, but just make a habit of stealing from every single enemy and You'll know if there's nothing to steal because it will say nothing to steal if it says couldn't steal anything Then that means they're still holding an item uh, There we go in this case a high potion uh, But you just haven't successfully stole it. Uh, I just did okay All right, then guys, well, I've just gone ahead and boosted the thievery skill damage by multiple times in these You know this last minute or so so just get into that habit, keep stealing from every enemy, and by the time we get to the part where we actually gain access to the thievery skill, which isn't until this 4, unfortunately, it will be doing so much damage that it's just going to be an ability you're going to fall in love with. Um, but if you neglect the steal skill now, if you neglect, you know, taking items from enemies, then it's not going to be a skill you're going to care much about later on, because it won't be doing much. Uh, but there we have it then, guys. Uh, thanks again to Red Mario for the tip on this. Um, as we come across those other skills, I'll share some info on them for you as well. Uh, but that's it for today, so come and check out the next live stream if you're able. Uh, I do stream Mondays, Wednesdays and Fridays, 2.30pm UK time. We're going to try and get the Platinum Trophy for Final Fantasy IX. Before that all-important date of April the 10th, which is when the Final Fantasy VII Remake will hopefully be showing itself to us uh, and will be in our hands, lest there be any further delays. But hope you guys have a wonderful day, and I'll see you next time. Take care.